mascara. That's pretty much all I'm, I'm going to do to the eyes for now. I'm going to come back to it. This blue is getting everywhere. Um, so I'm going to go in with this mascara. I'm going to be using the NARS Climax Mascara. This is also mentioned in my um, Sephora haul. I am going to be going in with these false lashes from Poshly Chic Luxury Eyelash Company. And I will have their information in the description bar, their IG, so you guys go check them out. I'm wearing the Style Greer. And I had this style on in that haul as well. So, yeah, check them out. Super affordable. If you're into, like, really um, comfortable, dramatic, and natural lashes, definitely check them out. So I'm going to pop these on, and I will be right back with the finishing of the face. All right, so lashes are on, and now I'm gonna go ahead and prime my face. I'm gonna be using the Tarte Quench Hydrating Primer. I just want a lot of hydration. It's like I told you guys before, it is just definitely cold out here. What? Oh, it comes out. It comes out blue. When I tested it in my Sephora haul, it definitely came out clear. Weird. I'm just gonna put that on my cheeks area. All right, on to the foundation. I'm going to be going in with the new Becca Skin Love Weightless Blur Foundation. It's infused with Glow Nectar Brightening Complex, and I have it in the shade Olive. I don't know, you guys. It looks a little light, so let's see. It's looking a little light. Okay. I knew I should have got the other one. Crap, this is so light. Alright, so that one, I, I took that off. I, I'm not even going to lie to you guys. The shade is just too light for me. And I already have dark pigmentation around my mouth. I say that so many times in my videos. But if something is too light down here, it's, it's going to look extremely ashy, even with color correction. I just... Anywho, so we're going to try another foundation that I've mentioned in a Sephora haul. This one is the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation, and I have it in the shade 7.5. So hopefully, hopefully this works. I think it'll work. I like to have more of a golden... Um, more of a golden yellow not not more so yellow that other one was a way too yellow whereas i like to have just a little golden like this so let's try this one This one is definitely more of a more hydrating than the other one it's more hydrating I don't know if it's because of the primer or if my face is already moisturized enough but so far it's super lightweight the Giorgio Armani luminous silk is super lightweight it definitely gives off a nice radiant look but not too glowy or dewy so now I'm gonna go ahead on and move on we'll come back to setting the rest of it I'm gonna go in with the new uh, First Aid Beauty Hello Fab Bendy Avocado Concealer and I have it in the number 4 oh man this one is super hydrating as well but I'd rather have a lot of hydration in the beginning because once you set all this powders and stuff girl then you're going to be feeling like oh my gosh I need some hydration so, all right, so I'm going to go ahead and set that because I see that it's starting to crease just a little bit using my Laura Mercier translucent powder. All right, now we're going to bronze the face. I'm going to go in with my Anastasia um, powder bronzer in the shade Saddle. You guys, I've been using this a lot lately. It's been actually giving me life. So I'm using this. Mixing it with my, you guys know my holy grail is the MAC one, but I've been using both, and I've been loving it. 
and I just went ahead and finished the rest of my face. So I did the highlighting. I used the Lancome Dual Finish Highlighter. I did the rest of my bottom lash line just using the same colors that we used on top. And I used the blush by MAC. This is Peach, Twi Peach Twist Sheer Tone Shimmer Blush. And I used that as a blush. And so now I'm just going to go ahead and go in with the lips because my camera is acting up today. I'm actually going to smoke out the bottom. I'm going to add this Marc Jacobs gel liner into my waterline. Just want to see what it will look like. I'm going in with the MAC lip pencil in the shade cork. Just going to line my lips with this. I'm going to go in with the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in the shade Biscotti. And that is the finished look, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this icy blue holiday look. So give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And until next time, love, peace, and beauty. Bye, guys.